You see me walking down the hall, perfectly happy with no worries, and always smiling with my friends. Yeah, that is how I try to keep it now, but not how it's always been. The reason is that it's because life is way too short. You never know when your time here will end. Therefore, I try to live every day like it's the last one, with my head held high, no regrets, and a smile on my face. I don't mean go out and do bad things because it might be your last day, no. I mean have peace in my soul, not letting insignificant things get to me or stress me out. This isn't how I've always been though. Particularly things and events throughout my life have led me to be this way. Before, I wouldn't be as happy for many reasons. My one and only focus was school, not friends, a boyfriend, or even my family. I was all school. It was my only distraction. Every day I would wake up at 5.30 in the morning to get ready for school. I was a straight A student, never getting in trouble and always following the rules. When I would go home, I would go straight to my room, do my homework, and then read or try to find something to keep me busy in there. I never had time for friends after school, and by 8.30 I'd be in bed already. But my mind would never rest due to the fact that I would always worry on how I would do at school the next day. I had no communication with my mother, so I couldn't tell her how I felt at the time. And my stepfather, well, he wasn't my favorite person, and we never got along. Problems and arguments at home were always present, mainly because of me since I was a stepchild. This caused me to be depressed all the time. It wasn't rare to hear me cry at night. It became more of the usual thing. Suicidal thoughts crossed my mind several times because I felt like there was no point of me living and causing so many problems at home. I would do everyone a favor if I just disappeared. But so much pain and stress I had inside helped me to finally open my eyes. I couldn't possibly keep living this way. I realized that wasn't what I wanted for me. I was alive, I was healthy, what else could I ask for? I had more than enough to be happy about and thankful for. I started to see life from a different perspective. I didn't need to be so worried all the time. I was way too young. To the problems I encountered, I learned not to give them as much importance. Those arguments at home were really affecting me, therefore I simply avoided them. I started to see everything in a positive way. My mother and I rebuilt our relationship, so she's now my best friend, the one person I can always count on and trust. I can say I found peace in myself. I always try to look for one reason to smile, even if there's ten trying to make me frown. Life is definitely beautiful, but it's always giving us obstacles and barriers. It's our job to overcome them. We can't let them stop us. Especially during our teenage years, we tend to give too much importance to things that don't really matter, yet at the time we feel like they do. But if it's not doing you any good, it's not worth your time. Life can be taken from us in a matter of seconds. When it will be, that we don't know. Which is exactly why we should be thankful for what we have now. And appreciate it, not wait until tomorrow to do it. It's best to live every day like it's your last day. Happy, not worrying too much, and always looking for one reason to smile, even if there is 100 trying to bring you down. This, I believe.